Electric cars have some of the best automotive tech in the world and today I'm going to tell you about five amazing features that are not only limited pretty much to electric cars but also are not available. You can't get any of them here in the United States. I'll even throw a bonus feature with never before seen footage into the mix at the end of the video which I think you'll really really love. All right let's get to the countdown right now. Welcome to E4Electric, your number one source of electric car scoop. If you want to keep up with everything that's going on in the world of electric cars, all you have to do is click on the subscribe button and the bell notification icon so you don't miss anything moving forward. All right, let's get to number one. Now, these are in no particular order. I think they are all equally awesome. But number one on my list is Volkswagen ID3 augmented reality head-up display. Now, head-up displays are becoming more and more common. I think they're really cool. Basically, this is when graphics and information is displayed and projected right onto the windshield. So as you're looking through the windshield on the road, you can see all of those directions and numbers and your speed right there without having to take your eyes off the road. If you've ever experienced one, you know it is really cool. But this head-up display is taking the game to a whole new level. It will be the most advanced head-up display on the market once ID3 cars being delivered to their customers in a couple of months. Now, augmented reality means that this technology will be adding elements into the real world, into the 3D world as you see it with your own eyes. All right, so for example, if you have to make a turn and every single one of us has missed a turn because we weren't really sure what's going on in the map compared to what the streets were seeing in front of us someone's yelling at us from the passenger seat no more with the augmented reality head of display you will never have to guess the arrows will be projected on the road exactly at the spot where you have to make the turn so it will be that simple pretty cool huh it will also outline cars and track them right in front of us. Also, it will put a little flag at the destination. So there's no mistake about where it is that we're going once we parked our car. And there are so many other uses that will be added in the future. As a matter of fact, I can't wait for this technology to make it into a BMW or even a Prius. You know, so everybody wins. Unfortunately, the Volkswagen ID3 will not be available in the United States, so enjoy Europe and the rest of the world. I'm not jealous, you're jealous. All right, moving on to the number two on our list, which is BYD rotating dashboard display. Now, I know there's been a lot of back and forth about whether the screen should be vertical, like in the Tesla Model S, or horizontal, like in the Tesla Model 3. Well, BYD figured out how to please both crowds and here it is. As you can see, with a touch of a button or even with your voice, you can rotate this monitor between the landscape and the portrait mode depending on which one is better for you. Now, honestly, I have to say that I don't think there's a perfect mode for a monitor, whether vertical or horizontal, for all drivers, for all scenarios. For example, if you're driving using a navigation system and tracking your car on a map, I would say that the vertical position is much better for you. However, if you're just sitting there charging your car and watching a YouTube video, hopefully on this channel, uh, then I'd say the horizontal position is way better for you, don't you think? It is only on sale in China, however, it looks like BYD will be bringing one of these two models to Europe, specifically Norway, in the next year or two. This feature is available on BYD's all-electric SUV Tang and now on its upcoming all-electric sedan Han. Now let's talk about one of my most favorite features and number three on my list, the cutest personal assistant you will ever meet, Neos Nomi. Before that, a quick reminder that this video and this channel is sponsored by Evanex, the Tesla community's accessory store. Use E4 Electric, the name of this channel, as a discount code for all of your purchases over $100. All right, number three, and try not to fall in love here, it's a personal assistant that you can find chilling on every single dashboard of an electric SUV made by Neo in China. It's got different emotions, different reactions, different faces, and even different props, like Carrot Top. Depending on which person inside the car is talking to her, she will turn her cute little head so she can talk directly to you while giving you the answer. Nomi will give you directions to your destination, play your favorite song, open a window, even take a selfie while counting backwards from three so you're ready for your best shot. Mine is this. 
sounds like a perfect girl. I uh, I wonder if she has a Bumble account. Neo is a publicly traded company here in the United States, but for now they're making their electric cars strictly in China. Number four comes from the same company, Neo, and it's uh, the battery swap. As you probably know, one of the biggest problems and the biggest obstacle to adopting electric cars is charging. Not only where you charge, but also how fast you can charge, especially if you're going on a long trip. And when you do charge your electric car, even at the DC fast charging stations, it takes about 45 minutes to go from zero to 100 to recharge your battery. If you live in a rental property, especially in an apartment complex, you probably don't have a dedicated charging spot, which makes owning an electric car very difficult. Neo's battery swapping stations solve both of these problems, especially because it takes anywhere between three to five minutes to completely replace your empty battery with a full battery. And that means that you can refuel your electric car faster than most gas cars. These swapping stations are pretty compact. They only take three parking spots and they are mobile. So Neo can figure out the right locations for these stations at certain times and certain seasons so they are the most convenient for their drivers. Now this way you don't have to worry about the degradation of your battery because this is something that Neo worries about. All you do is get the 100% fully charged new battery and off you go. And by the way, it's free. If you chose to buy a smaller size battery for your Neo, but all of a sudden you have a need for a bigger size battery, for example, a road trip, you can still swap for a bigger size battery for a small extra fee. By the way, Tesla used to have a very similar technology back in the day where they could swap a battery on a Model S in under 90 seconds. At that time, Elon Musk did a big presentation where they swapped batteries not just in one, but in two Teslas while a gas-powered Audi was refueling and they were able to get it done before Audi was fully finished. So now Neo is uh, the only company with ever-growing uh, battery swapping station network in the world that's able to refuel your electric car faster than a gas one. Tesla had only one battery swapping location in Harris Arrange, California, but after a couple of years decided to close the program. All right, we are at number five, but don't forget there's a bonus feature that's still coming up, so stick around for that. Uh, now, this particular feature I really like. I really wish it was available here in the United States, and I think so do you. I'm talking about side mirror cameras. At this point, pretty much the only car in the market that has this feature is the Audi e-tron and the Audi e-tron Sportback. I was lucky enough to drive the e-tron last year in Spain, and I gotta tell you, I absolutely love this feature. Obviously, the side mirror cameras are good for the aerodynamics of any car and help the range of any electric car. They look pretty cool. However, when it comes to the Audi e-tron, I thought the implementation could be a little better. Not only you had to refocus your eyes just a little bit more than when you look at the regular side mirrors, but also they're sitting so low that I have to basically take my eyes off the road so much that it made me a little uncomfortable. If you've been watching my channel for a while, you probably know I'm not a big fan of the Honda e. However, I think the way they've implemented the side mirror cameras is pretty much perfect, specifically because of where they've placed those monitors. My eyes don't have to act that differently from where they would usually be when they would be checking the regular side mirrors. And for that, kudos to Honda. But at the end of the day, the side mirror cameras is a great improvement for any cars because they're essentially eliminating your blind spots. Those monitors can be adjusted specifically for your eyes, especially if you're going from the day mode to the night mode and the cameras can be used for so many other cool features, including being used as security cameras while you are away. All right, and now we have come to the bonus feature, and this one can only be found in the upcoming Xpeng P7 all-electric sedan. Now, you probably remember the Christmas dance of the Tesla Model X, and I've heard some people even dance with it, whoever those crazy people are. Now, as amazing as the Model X dance is because of the doors and the wings, it doesn't exactly have an amazing light show because, you know, it just has two headlights. And also, it can only do one song. P7, on the other hand, doesn't have the moving doors or the wings, but it does have a full 
light bar so you can do a much better job with the light show also it has an extended list of songs you can pick out of and then adjust the light show to the beat of each song the only other electric car that i can think of that has a full light bar on the front of the vehicle that can change colors is rivian both of their electric truck and their suv has that ability so i'm wondering if they're working on a number for us as well all right, before I give you a quick taste of P7's light show to one of my most favorite classical music pieces, I want to give a shout out to all of my Patreons. And if you want to become a part of my Patreon community, go to patreon.com slash e4electric. I also put that link in the description of this video. All right, enjoy this awesome piece. This is exclusive footage, which you will not find anywhere else except for this channel. Looking forward to your comments. Other than that, see you guys next time. And remember, to stay charged.